What's up, everybody? You're tuned in to thegameraccess.com with your host, Nick McCandless. Now, we all know the Sony PlayStation Network has been down for a little over two weeks. And this past Sunday, Sony actually held a press conference in Japan dedicated to this event. This press conference was actually held on a Japanese holiday. Now, Sony didn't release too much information that we didn't already know. They said that credit card information, they don't know if it's been stolen or not. There's been numerous reports online of people's information being stolen, finances being interrupted, but nothing's been confirmed by the banks up to this point. Could that change? Yes, I hope not. But passwords, addresses, all that's been accessed, which is why you'll be required to change your password when the PlayStation Network service goes back live. The one thing Sony did reveal that we did not already know is how they're going to compensate the customers. They said that they're going to provide all PS3 users with 30 days of free PlayStation Plus subscription, 30 days of Curiosity's Music Unlimited service, and they'll bring the Welcome Back program offering free downloadable content to compensate for this outage. What content will be offered through the Welcome Back program still remains a mystery. We'll have to wait and see what happens there. But how they're going to offer this content is what makes me curious. Are they going to be able to provide you a variety of games to choose from, or are they going to pick the games for you? I hope this is not how Sony executes it, but I'm feeling like Sony's going to kind of use this as a way to promote PlayStation Plus because since everyone's going to officially be in PlayStation Plus within that 30-day period, they'll say, here's the free content we're offering you. All you got to do is go to the PlayStation Plus section and you'll get it for free. So they're going to use PlayStation Plus and market it to those who were not previously subscribers. Now, none of this has been confirmed, so please take this with a grain of salt. But I have a feeling how Sony is going to execute it. Is this right? Now, Sony came out and they finally released the details about this whole hacking situation and things like that. But the thing is, they didn't reveal information until a week after the servers were down, leaving the public, leaving them clueless. They didn't know what was going on. And I feel that was a bad move on Sony's part. Now, while Sony did come out and say, hey, we wanted to get the facts straight before we released them to the public, you guys could have released a minor update with the information you did have just to keep us all updated. The PlayStation Network service had been down for almost three weeks up to this point. And this is directly after the launch of SOCOM 4, one of the PS3's largest exclusives to hit in the year of 2011. So this is a huge event for Sony. Stocks dropped out the water. Now, yes, the stocks are going back up since Sony held the press conference, but Sony still has long-term effects they'll have to deal with. They have lawsuits, they have Congress wanting answers from them, and then if credit card information was stolen, there's going to be a lot more issues to deal with. So, do you feel that Sony is pursuing excellent or mediocre integrity with this whole outage situation? Do you think they're treating the customers in the right manner? Do you feel that the Welcome Back program and the 30 Days of Curiosity and PlayStation Plus is enough to compensate for this PlayStation Network outage? Do you think the Welcome Back program is going to even be worth the three weeks of without PlayStation Network? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section. You can also contact me at admin at thegameraxis.com and follow me on Twitter at twitter.com forward slash thegameraxis. Curious to see what you guys have to say. Let's get a discussion going and we'll see where our ideas go. So thank you guys for watching. Keep checking back for thegameraxis.com. There's going to be a lot more content coming to the site, so keep checking back. Thank you guys for tuning in. I'm out. Access granted.